is an extraordinary story about World War II and the bombing of Darwin, which I think that um, very few people in Australia actually know about. Who's going to choose the location? We meet a bunch of different women in the town, representative of Darwin's multicultural tapestry. So we have uh, Indigenous young women, we have a Chinese Australian family who run a shop in Smith Street. Uh, we have a Japanese Australian family here, and Mr. Takahashi's the head of that family, who's the town's photographer. There will be hardship and sacrifice. And watching over all of these people are the nuns over at Garden Point Mission. The music for Mr. Takahashi is all performed live to support the mood and the themes that are coming out on the play. Most of the music is performed by myself. I play it on the cello and the viola, a wooden flute and a guitar. And the cast also join in quite a lot using their voices and um, rhythm and movement and using their bodies to help to create a soundscape. You, Japanese. I'm Merrily Mills and I play two roles in the production, that of Agnes Lamb who is the wife of the administrator Austin Lamb and I also play the role of a post office worker. The story of the Japanese. I'm always interested in the stories of just ordinary people and in this case I chose uh, females in particular because they're often not represented in war stories, war films, war plays. I thought it'd be interesting to have a look at women and girls. And um, yeah, just ordinary people in the wrong spot at the wrong time, usually. Put a smile on that lovely face. You'll trip on that bottom bit. Yeah, I learned stuff that, uh, you know, Mr Takahashi being, uh, being a spy for the Australians. Beautiful stuff. I give it nine and a half out of ten felt real, you know what I mean? Like I didn't really know much about, you know, much about the bombing of Darwin, but I really wanted to come and see this and I thought it was really good. Compelling, amazing, emotional, um, I want to see it again as well. Yeah, I would totally recommend the show. Yeah, there are some really beautiful performances. Um, yeah, it's a great set, it's a wonderful design. I had a great time. So it is really moving and it's a story that was really well researched. I just found out 10 years in the making to really get the true stories of what it really was for Australia to be bombed, to be on the forefront, close to the Japanese, you know, in World War II.